Alrighty, everybody, welcome back to Final Fantasy X. We are now about to enter the Cloister of Trials. At least that's how they were hyping it up in the uh, cutscene prior. So, let's do this! <laughs> what the? I guess I have to find those things. Let's see. Um. Oh, I see the slight change in colors on the on the floor. <laughs> no, let me go! You do not get to stop holding me! Rawr. Easy square, let me go. I'm not. Mm. I don't like this already. Let me go. That's another square right there, so that means this there. And. Alright, and then that's another square up there. Um. Nope. Okay, that actually makes things so much simpler. We do this. And we go down here. seemed way too easy. So what is it? That's obnoxious. I'm just gonna say that right now. Literally, it's right there, right outside. Like, am I... Mm. Okay, now if you need to find the sideways purple. I think this is, uh-huh. Nope. I found the rest, and I think I found
Okay, so that's what those... Okay, so I need to do it five more times and then I'm done. This is going to be tedious. <laughs> Let's see. One, two, three, Wait, am I misreading? Uh, oh, I'm looking for, I guess.
Alrighty, so far... This is... Not terrible? Also, I don't think the, th the pieces are constantly moving around. <sighs> Sorry for the yawn <laughs> just now. Just woke up. I only meant to take a little nap between recordings. this, sadly. Puzzle done? So, five puzzles total. Alrighty. Clear though, I have no qualm with it being a little short on the shorter side. No, because there is an option to save just in case there's some bullshit. We're gonna save. Serena.
light and lunar. was not <sighs> you doing that berserk tale pretty much sealed your fate also what's with that platform that was just shown <laughs> like is that where my um summon is supposed to go well I guess I probably would have summoned but you a little over leveled. We're here. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm not a little over leveled. I'm very over leveled. Yes, let's go. This isn't a faith. It's just an empty statue. That statue lost its power as a faith long ago. It is Lord Zeon, the first faith of the final summoning. What you see before you is all that remains of him. Lord Zeon is... his soul is gone. Gone? You mean, there is no final Aeon? But fear not. Lady Unaleska will show you the path. The final Aeon will be yours. The Summoner and the final Aeon will join powers. Go to her now. Inside, the Lady awaits. Yuna, wait! Aaron, you knew this was gonna happen, didn't you? Yes. Why didn't you tell us? If I had told you the truth, 
would that really have stopped you from coming? Yeah, everyone was pretty much planning on coming, but ugh. Kimari knows. Kimari goes first. Yuna is safe. Kimari protect. See anyone? Oh. Lady <laughs> Welcome to Zanarkand. I congratulate you, Summoner. You have completed your pilgrimage. I will now bestow you with that which you seek. The final summoning will be yours. Now, choose. Eh? You must choose the one whom I will change. To become the faith of the final summoning. <sighs> there must be a bond between Chosen and Summoner, for that is what the final summoning embodies. The bond between husband and wife, mother and child, or between friends. If that bond is strong enough, its light will conquer sin. A thousand years ago, I chose my husband Zeon as my faith. Our bond was true, and I obtained the final Aeon. There is nothing to fear. You will soon be freed of worry and pain. For once you call forth the final Aeon, your life will end. Death is the ultimate and final liberation. Your father, Braska, chose this path. She didn't even tell you her name. If I turn back, who will defeat Sin? Would you have some other summoner and his guardians go through this? But... My lord, there must be another way. This is the only way we got now. Fine. Make me the faith. I've been doing some thinking. My dream is back in the other Xanarkand. I wanted to make that runt into a star blitz player. Show him the view from the top, you know. But now I know there's no way home for me. I'm never gonna see him again. My dream's never gonna come true. So make me the faith. I'll fight sin with you, Braska. Then maybe my life will have meaning, you know. Don't do this, Jet. If you live, there may be another way. We'll think of something, I know. Believe me, I thought this through. Besides, I ain't getting any younger, so I might as well make myself useful. Checked? What? You're not gonna try to stop me too? Sorry. I mean... Thank you. Braska still has to fight Sin, Oren. Guard him well. Make sure he gets there. Uh, well, let's go. Lord Braska, checked. What do you want now? Sin always comes back. It comes back after the calm, every time. The cycle will continue, and your deaths will mean nothing. 
But there's always a chance it won't come back this time. It's worth trying. I understand what you're saying, Oren. I'll find a way to break the cycle. You... have a plan? Checked? Trust me, I'll think of something. <laughs> Break it. But how? What, you got a plan now? If one of us has to become a faith, I volunteer. Me too, Yuna. That still won't change anything, you know? You'd bring the calm, and then what? That won't break the cycle. Listen, you want to defeat Sin and keep Yuna alive. You don't want Sin to come back, yeah? That is just not gonna happen, brother, you know? If you want everything, you'll end up with nothing. He's not asking for everything. He's wanting you lot to, to actually analyze the situation. Ugh. And not to mention a fruitless cycle that does nothing. Why? Why cater to such a cycle? Ugh. I say we grill Unalaska for pro for quest with questions and see just hmm. if the final Aeon becomes sin, how? There has to be something doing that. And if we know what that something is, we just find it and kill it. Or break it if it's a machine and kill it if it's a person or a living thing. Either way, we can crush it. We just need to know where, who, what it is. It's not... <clears throat> I have like four brain cells maybe. And I'm able to see this. But I want everything! Now you're being childish. I give up. So what would an adult do then? They know they can just throw away a summoner. Then they can do whatever they like. You're right. I might not even have a chance. But no way am I gonna just stand here and let Yuna go. And what... Oren said about there being a way? I think it's true. You'll think of... Something? Yes. I'll go ask Unaleska. She's got to know something. You really think she'll help you? I don't know. But I have to try. This is my story. It'll go the way I want it. Or I'll end it here. Wait. You say it's your story. But it's my story too, you know? It would be so easy to let my fate just carry me away, following the same path my whole life through. But I know I can't. What I do, I do with no regrets. That was a lot of cutscenes though, so just in because I feel like there is a boss fight, fight coming. I feel it in my bones. So we're going to save again.
Whoa. Have you chosen the one to become your faith? Who will it be? Might I ask something first? Will Sin come back even should I use the final summoning to defeat it? Sin is eternal. Every Aeon that defeats it becomes Sin in its place. And thus is Sin reborn. So that's why Jack became Sin. Sin is an inevitable part of Spira's destiny. It is never-ending. Never-ending? But... but... if we atone for our crimes, Sin will stop coming back, yeah? Someday it'll be gone, yeah? Will humanity ever attain such purity? Why are we talking about the teachings as if they have this any sort of value? The teachings state that we can exercise sin with complete atonement. It's been our only hope all these years. Lulu, I thought by now we established that Yevon is full of shit. Like they have nothing good for the world at all. They're just grubby bastards. Hope is comforting. It allows us to accept however tragic it might be. Where is the sense in all this? Braska believed in Yevon's teachings and died for them. Jack believed in Braska and gave his life for him. They chose to die because they had hope. <laughs> Yevon's teachings and the final summoning give the people of Spira hope. Without hope, they would drown in their sorrow. Now choose. Who will be your faith? Who will be the one to renew Spira's hope? No one. I would have gladly died. I live for the people of Spira, and would have gladly died for them. But no more. The final summoning is a false tradition that should be thrown away. No. It is our only hope. Your father sacrificed himself to give that hope to the people. So they would forget sorrow. Wrong. My father... My father wanted to make Spiro's sorrow go away, not just cover it up with lies. Sorrow cannot be abolished. It is meaningless to try. My father... I'm assuming that you just gave up then, Unaleska? So I... I will live with my sorrow. I will live my own life. I will defeat sorrow in his place. I will stand my ground and be strong. I don't know when it will be, but someday I will conquer it. And I will do it without false hope. Poor creature. You would throw away hope. Your hope? Well, that does not mean that other hope cannot be found. In your sorrow. It is better for you to die in hope than to live in despair. Let me be your liberator. Oh, wait a minute. I know, I recognize this room. This is the room where, um, Titus is, um, this is it. crest now is. is. the time to choose. Die and be free of pain. Or live and fight your sorrow. Now is the time to shape your stories. Your fate is in your hands. Yuna needs Kimari. Kimari protect Yuna. Well, I'm fighting. I can't believe we're gonna fight Lady Unaleska. Give me a break. You can always run. 
Ha! I'd never forgive myself. No way. Not if I ran away now. Even in death, yeah? <sighs> My thoughts exactly. Yuna! This is our story. Now let's see this thing through together. Bitch, you ain't gonna live. We gonna have fun with you. Let's get some haste going, baby. That's it. That's all the HP you have. What? to say where's Essena down the mugger only a stamina tablet There's more. You can't. There's more. There's something down there. I'm more than willing to bet. It's that zombie shit. Uh. Okay. So, so her basic attack is dispel. And I was like, Tidus looks a little slower. And... Oh wait, Kamari. Kamari did in fact have a piece of you. So I think... Reaper of Souls, vulnerable to holy. You know what? She's probably gonna counter attack me with silence, right? Eat this then, witch. That's actually really pretty. Oh no. What are you doing? Mega! Ah. 
Okay. Pick up Yuna. Uh. Oh right, he's blinded. I'm like, why are you on the floor? For you to die in hope and live in despair. Bitch. How's this for living in despair? One shot your bitch ass. on you if you want to have live in despair that's your business don't try to drag other people into it if and I also die, you're dead go go to the so far plane you're already dead Spira's only hope then we'll find Spira a new hope fool there is no other way. Even if there was, even if you did destroy sin, you, Yevon, the immortal, would only create sin anew. You, okay, Yevon, so we find this you, Yevon, and crush it like the bug it is. Forgive or me. Or pest. It's like a cockroach then, if it's immortal. <laughs> oh, do we have a do we have a bottle of of you Yevon killer? Like cockroach killer? <laughs> Ever yep, everyone participated. And thank you for more level three key spheres. I cannot believe what we just did. Let's do something more unbelievable. What? Destroy sin, so it won't come back. And without the final Aeon. I don't know how just yet, but I'll find out. Okay, so apparently if you leave this room without getting that sigil, or crest, you cannot get it unless you beat a super boss. So let's try that road and see. Does that give me a chest? I don't see a chest. Let's go this way then. Chest! Also, why can't I go in the middle? Let me go in the middle. Re. <sighs> huh? Oh, thank God! I thought I thought for a moment. What? There's something. I thought for a moment the game like froze on me. I'm like, no! It's about you, right? I am also an unsent. You were not surprised. I think I kind of knew. It was you and Aleska, wasn't it? When Braska and Jekt died defeating Sin, I just couldn't accept it. I came back here, tried to avenge them. But she struck me down. Somehow I made my way, crawling down Mount Gagazet. But my strength left me, just outside Bevel. That's where Kamari found me. I told him about Yuna, just before I died. I've been wandering ever since, never going to the far plane. Aaron. Don't make that face. 
Being dead has its advantages. I was able to ride Sin and go to your Xanarkand. And you've been watching over me since then, haven't you? Why? What's the big idea? Why me? It is one of those things that is difficult to explain. Very well, I will show you. My memories. Can I ask you one last favor? Uh... Nah, never mind. Out with it. Okay, listen good. Take care of my son. My son in Xanarkand. He's such a crybaby. He needs someone there to hold his hand, see? Take care of him, will you? But how am I supposed to go to Xanarkand? <laughs> hey, you said it yourself. There must be a way to get there, right? You'll find it. Uh, all right. I will. I give you my word. I'll take care of your son. I'll guard him with my life. Thanks, Oren. You were always such a stiff. But that's what I liked about you. That is why. A promise made between friends. Alrighty, everybody. This episode has been going on for almost... 50 minutes so I'm gonna call it here and talk about a finale of a fight <laughs> see y'all next episode take it easy